I'm just outside of downtown Whitefish where 210 multifamily units have been proposed for development, which developers hope will ease a growing housing problem in Flathead County. We're trying to fulfill the huge need of housing that this town has encountered over the last you know, several years. Alpine 9340 developer Alberto Valner hopes to be part of the solution with the proposed housing development sitting on 10 acres of land on the corner of Highway 93 and Highway 40. You go to a restaurant, you go to the hospital, you talk to the firemen, you talk to the policemen, you talk to the people who work at the retail stores, they have been pushed out. They have been pushed out. They're having to drive 40 minutes to uh, Kalispell. They have to be driving 20 minutes to Columbia Falls and we do not want to become another Jackson Hole. We do not want to become another Park City. Under the Whitefish Legacy Housing Program, 10% of the proposed multifamily units would be restricted for affordable housing. The development would also include a number of features to complement the apartments. A dog park, which we will. We want to provide a gym, community room, fire pits, areas for people to congregate. If approved, the project would consist of six buildings being built in two phases, with housing units becoming available in approximately two and a half years. This can be an emblematic entrance point to the city of Whitefish, as well as providing a huge, you know, void in the market, which is providing a, you know, a significant amount of apartment units in the marketplace. The project will go in front of the Whitefish City Council on Monday at 7 p.m. In Whitefish, Sean Wells, MTN News.